Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for Taurus. This is going to be for your uh, second half of your November from the 16th to 30th. We're gonna, we are going to take a look and see what is going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. Um, and then we will take a look at your person to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situations. Switch the roles if you want. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in wanting to uh, follow me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that is dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Also, if you guys are interested in wanting to book a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. So. How about Taurus here? What messages do we have for, for Taurus and love and the person that they are connecting with? For the second half of their November from the 16th to the 30th, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, Four of Cups, Ten of Cups, the Judgment card, Sagittarius Energy, Ten of Wands, the Moon, Cancer, Pisces, and the Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have the Four of Cups, Ten of Cups. Judgment, Sagittarius Energy, Ten of Wands, the Moon, Cancer, Pisces, and the Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Okay. It does seem like somebody here is looking for an opportunity here with you where I feel like somebody here is having a hard time letting this connection go or releasing this relationship here. Yeah, I do feel like some here is heavily spying on you, checking up on you here to see if you have moved on to somebody else. Okay, but it seems like whoever this is, I do believe that there is separation here where some here is coming back around for a second chance. Taurus. Four of Cups. Why is the Four of Cups here? And the Four of Pentacles. Yeah, some here is holding on to hope that this is not over. Yeah, some here is holding on to hope that there is an opportunity to rebuild this tower here with you. The Tower, Aries, Scorpio, Energy, the Judgment card, and the Six of Cups. Yeah, someone here is missing you a lot. Refusing to let go of this relationship here. Refusing to let go of the soulmate connection, the soul connection that they have here with you. The Moon, and the Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy, and the Knight of Cups, and the Page of Swords here. Yeah, you see someone here spying on you, watching you, trying to communicate here with you. Uh, to see how you're doing, to see if you moved on from them. Um, if this person is definitely going to reach out to you with some sort of communication here. You know, this person could be doing it in subtle ways if you have your uh, social media open up to them. You know, they could be liking your post and commenting, commenting on your post to see if you would respond. What else do we have here for Taurus? What else does Taurus need to know? Look out for work on. For November, second half of their November from the 16th to 30th, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for uh, Taurus. What else is Taurus, uh, the person that they're dealing with? Their true feelings and intentions towards Taurus. We have the Two of Cups, Two of Swords, King of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, Ten of Pentacles, and the Sun. So the Two of Cups here again. Oh, shoot. Two of Swords. King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Knight of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, Ten of Pentacles, and the Sun, Leo Energy. Okay. Yeah, someone here is definitely rushing in, trying to rekindle this relationship here. Yeah, they're really hoping that this is not over. Yeah, they're really hoping that this is not over here because I feel like this person sees you as their fulfillment and their happiness here. This person sees you as their happily ever after, their, their forever person, okay? The thing is, I feel like this person is really indecisive here. Yeah, it just seems like this person is really indecisive. The Two of Cups and the King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. The Two of Swords and the Eight of Cups. The King of Pentacles and the Moon, Cancer, Pisces here. 
Knight of Swords in the Wheel of Fortune. Ten of Pentacles in the Seven of Cups. In the Sun. In the Eight of Swords. This person can't stop thinking about you. This person's fearful that you're going to walk away from them. With the Wheel of Fortune here, I just feel like this person's having a hard time moving on from you here. This person's resisting in letting you go with the Sun of Wands here. Yeah, I just feel like this person is fantasizing about the day that you guys come back together. But I feel like it's not going to happen here. Yeah, I feel like it's not going to happen for some of you guys. Some of you guys are not going to take this on. What else do we have here for? Taurus. What else does Taurus need to know? Look out for. Work on. When it comes to this love connection for the second half of their November from the 16th to 30th. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Taurus. Two of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Eight of Wands, Three of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, and the Chariot, Cancer Energy. So the Two of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Eight of Wands, Three of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, and the Chariot. Eight of Pentacles and the Chariot, Cancer Energy here. What else do you guys need to know, look out for, work on? Yeah, you know, someone. I, I just feel like someone is trying everything that they can. They're trying to gather all the resources, pull everything in their power to communicate here with you and talk to you here and make this work. Two of Pentacles here and the Ten of Wands again. Yeah, this person's going to try really hard. Um, but I feel like it's going to met, be met with resistance and conflict here. I just feel like this person's also really pissed off about, uh, 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 pissed off about, uh, you know, uh, pissed off of themselves here. Because I feel like this person knows that they, what they did to you was wrong. Yeah, this person's just really worried that this can't come back together again. Yeah, this person wants to bring this relationship back together here, Taurus. Eight of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords. And I feel like this person's being honest and truthful here. Okay. But, you know, you might not be trusting this individual here, Taurus. You know, I feel like you're making a run from this. Yeah. You know, I just feel like this person has verbal diarrhea of the mouth where I feel like this person just lies a lot here. This person just lies and lies and lies and lies and lies. Okay? So, you know, I just feel like you just don't trust this individual or that you just don't really want this to come back together or that you don't want anything to do with this person. That Yeah, this person's like totally fantasizing about the day you guys come back together. Kind of like a hard left when it comes to the situation so taurus i hope that this was helpful i hope that this resonated if it did leave a comment down in the comment section below like share subscribe hit the notification bell i'll speak to you guys in the next one thanks guys bye